Hey, welcome to How Do I Know You with your host, Mark and Duane. What up? And today, once again, leave that five-star review. Uh, buy us a cup of coffee. We are now on Patreon. Uh, links in the bio of our Instagram, which is HCIKY1. I will let Dwayne put that link in our podcast stuff, so yes. it's even easier. And we just really need it, guys. We want to keep it going, but we need money. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Not even... It's just a digital... Think of it as a digital collection plate. <laughs> it's an NFT. It's an NFT. Just of us, all the time. Did you hear the NFT, like fucking like space went from like everyone's like oh nfts now that shit's down like 90 percent yeah that makes sense so something super popular someone like and then those those big ones catch on really fast and then after those catch on they probably flood the market of like this stuff making everything devalued right. <laughs> like the just how shit works business that shit is crazy yeah but uh real quick talking about patreon uh just so that you guys know so you guys know the tiers it's just there's levels to it and like the biggest one what we're gonna have like exclusive stuff on it so if you want to see more of us which to be honest i mean like you do it's fine you oh, do oh yes it's cool yes, you do. You it's do. fine with us we've accepted the fact and you know we're willing to give it to you <laughs> we will whore ourselves out <laughs> for this content uh but no i just with all that stuff again it just allows us to do more things yeah and just better things for you guys um get better guests and shit like that but yeah, um, today is today's show. I need I need your help, you, and then I also need your help, people listening. You, you guys out there. Okay, so I have this problem. Okay, and people have told me since since high school this stuff, but I never believed them. I'm like, no, that's just how you see it. Like, I'm because I'm not doing that. It's not that's not how it is. Mm-hmm. So people always uh, tell me that I'm a flirt, right? But to me, I'm just being nice. Right. Like, I'm being, a, like, a polite person and just, just being myself. Right. How do I balance it so where people stop thinking of me as a flirt? Stop whipping your dick out. I Again, I am that. not willing to do that. So, <laughs> what are the other <laughs> options? <laughs> what are the other options to this, sir? Um, but see, like, when we were in school, like, and this is from, like, Bancroft days to like college and shit i saw it more in college like yeah because i mean yeah you wouldn't go to my high school right, so. right. like middle school we were younger and like none of us were really like out there like that you yet. want to tell the story oh, of the weirdest, I, I was going to. the weirdest shit you ever saw i was going to, but uh <laughs> yeah i'll get to it now to to add some backstory to mark's uh i fl- the, you know his whole he flirts uh, when he just talks to people or women <laughs> um, no, people, people, people. Um, <laughs> yeah, um, it really is. <laughs> but one of the most oddest interactions I've ever had with Mark is we were in a history class. I forgot. I don't know if it was like ancient civilization or some shit like that. It was easy class. Yeah, very easy class. Um, but we sat in the back, uh, as the cool kids do, and there were two girls that were in front of us. One, uh, did one have red hair? I don't know. But we never talked to them before this. No, no, right? And us being us, like, these are, like, really, like, the early stages of the podcast. Because we would just fucking joke around throughout the whole class, right? And one, the teacher was cool. That was the first teacher that we had that would fucking do, like, hey, I have a lecture. And he would do the lecture, but also it's, like, the fucking PowerPoints on the on the website, too. So if you don't, wanna, right. if you don't care, you can't stay for this, just go on the fucking website or whatever. Right. And for attendance, all he would do was tell people to to write their name on a piece of paper that was passed around right. the class. Right. So um, I'm going to say one of the girls had red hair, right? So it was a chick. One of them had red hair. Another one was brunette. And they sat in front of us, right? And they were also, uh, I'm assuming, friends. I would hope so because they always <laughs> talk. I'm um, like, but uh, so one day we, I think we were leaving the class early. Yeah, even before it began, yeah. we're like, oh, let's just like sign our name and then let's yeah. go. We let's had to do bounce, something. right? Yeah. We, we had something to do. So um, Mark was like, oh, we should just ask these uh, two. The lovely young ladies. Yeah. That's how I used to talk back in college. <laughs> we should just ask these two to sign us in. And I was like, all right. So then 
uh, I don't even remember how like the interaction started. I literally don't. I think I started it. I was just like, I was just like, hey, or something like that. I just right. said, hey, and they turned around. Right. So then, I was like, hey, <laughs> I pushed them. He grabbed one of them. <laughs> you by the sign nipples. me in, right? Right by the nipples. Come here. <laughs> Because <laughs> I'm a gentleman. That's how you do it when you're a gentleman. That's how you, that's how you, you know what I'm saying? Let them know that, that you're here. Uh, but we had never talked to these girls beforehand, right? Mm-hmm. And so Mark is talking to one of the girls, the, the brunette, right? And it, this is my... Uh, I don't even know the fucking word. This is my, like... Uh, His point of view. Yeah, because he, he, was, he was already, like, leaving, and he was by the door, and right. I was I was the one no, asking. No, no, no. Like, I was sitting down, but, like, I had I was already, like... I had my backpack on, and I was just uh-huh. like, all right. And then you were talking to the girls. So I was just kind of waiting for the shit to, like, happen, right? So I was waiting for them to both say yes. I was like, all right, cool. Thanks, guys. Peace. So as I'm sitting there, Mark's talking. Well, they both start talking, and he's like... And I think you said it first, and then she was like, What? And then you guys both got closer, right? <laughs> so from my perspective, I'm not paying attention to like the first half of the conversation. And then I finally look up and all I see is like, all I see is Mark getting closer and this girl getting closer, right? And they're getting closer and closer and closer and closer. And they're like fucking like right here. And i'm like i'm like honestly if one of them just like stuck out there just a little bit they kissing right <laughs> so in my mind i'm I, I, I this is when i turn it i'm like yo what the fuck is going on <laughs> i'm like oh it's lit i, I, I want to say i kind of remember like because I, I i to me in my head I, I really was just asking the girl like can you sign us in right i didn't even realize we were that close right until so, you said something but i remember when i when when she said yeah or whatever I, I get up and turn to you, and you're just your face is like, what? <laughs> like, what's going on right now? Like, your mind was blown. Like, dick was hard as a rock. I was like, yo, we about to train these two bitches. I have no idea what's going on, but I'm ready. Like, <laughs> we're gonna go, man. <laughs> because I was like, from that perspective, that that's still one of the funniest days ever for me. Literally, they were just. I was just like, all right, this is this is a good distance to talk, but they didn't stop. So in my mind, I'm like, yo, why are they getting closer? Why are they getting closer? Oh, they're about to make out. Oh, it's lit. <laughs> like, yo, fuck this class. <laughs> what did Mark say? <laughs> I'm like, yo, this nigga hard. I gotta give him his props on this. <laughs> Best line ever. Hey, girl, can you uh, sign, sign me in for attendance? And just start making out. I was like, <laughs> yeah. ooh, this nigga's a beast. <laughs> like, like, <laughs> I'm a someone else self-help books. So I'm like, it's very, very specific to your situation. It didn't help anybody. <laughs> This is the wedge golden play. <laughs> Are you in class? Fuck, you don't even gotta be in class. <laughs> It'd be a regular day. Oh, fuck. But, oh, man. Yeah. But I, I remember thinking, like, because I remember when you told me that, I was just like, we weren't that close. Like, I don't remember us being that like, close. Y'all noses was like, y'all then, they could have touched. But then, <laughs> but then I started thinking about what you said, and I remember this one class in high school, um, it was like, half criminology half uh psychology and the girl in front of me she was like a friend hmm. sort of like we knew each other and shit like that we didn't hang out that much but we, we like knew each other from past years right and every time she would she would turn around and we would talk um i kind of remember i was just like wait i do that so sometimes but like it's never it's never a thing it's never like in my mind like oh i'm gonna get this close and right. this means something and we're about to kiss and shit like that because we would talk and it would be like that close right because i remember someone taking a picture and we were like this close and i was just like why am i that close yeah, I don't know, but but I was just like, yo, because I, I honestly after that I was like, you have to fuck her. Like I think this could happen. <laughs> I don't think we. I think we moved that. <laughs> yeah, for real, I think we did. Like I, for, something happened, but like or we, other people started sitting there. For, yeah. They started getting there first, where the the girls used to sit. Yeah, we was like, oh, that's yeah, weak. Like, we but yeah. fucking. We also cheated in that class, which was the, the most yeah, fucking. Was, I don't think we got away with it. I don't think he. I just think he didn't care. I feel like we got at this away with point. It. <laughs> <laughs> it seemed very obvious from my point of view. So. Nah, but a lot of the shit during that time period that we think about now like kids cheating now is very obvious yeah but we were like a little sly about it or whatever like if you especially for the people out there who are in college or whatever or if you like go to those weird schools that like they allow you to like bring materials for shit one of the greatest tricks ever was the scantron trick which is they they would at least for our college they would tell us because they wouldn't provide us with the fucking scantrons they would tell us go buy a scantron before before the test or whatever so what i would do is 
fucking write notes on the scantrons, right? And of course, don't be an idiot. Don't forget that the, the, the fucking notes on the scantron. Or two scantrons. Right. Uh, oh, yes. <laughs> I forgot about that play. But uh, buy a scantron, write notes on the scantron, right? Especially because they have that box that says notes for some odd reason. For the teacher. Uh, I guess. Um, but <clears throat> fucking write out all the, like, the little key shit that you need to know. And then fucking just erase it right after, right? And then, boom, that was like an easy cheat. Another way, if you guys want to get really, like, really just not sophisticated at all with this cheating shit, which was, was the scratch paper play, which was literally because the teachers wouldn't check it. So you would grab a piece of scratch paper. The front side would be blank. The back side had all your fucking notes. Right, <laughs> like, yeah. Or the index card shit. Like, there were so many ways. And I was like, college is great because they don't even care. Oh, it's easy. <clears throat> uh, but, yeah, like, all that shit from, like, that I could see as, like... From outside point of view, because we never talked to those girls again, so it was no, no like confirmation of like you were trying something. It was just no. like it was just very like <laughs> I, in my mind, I was like, "Yo, she is with it. Whatever, <laughs> whatever you need to do, it's going to happen." Oh, twenty year old Dwayne, <laughs> like she's with it, man. Like I yeah, feel probably. like, feel but like I, was, I was happen. because my mind wasn't there. And my mind was like, "I'm not trying to flirt. I'm not. I'm like, I'm I'm trying to accomplish a goal of like leaving this class." And I feel like at that time. I think you had a girl. Wanna, oh, yeah, that too. Yeah, but I want to say you did. At this point, that yeah. looking back, I'm like, shouldn't, shouldn't have mattered. <laughs> shouldn't <laughs> have mattered. Should have just did it. Fuck it. Yeah. Especially the other girl in another class. The one asked a cigarette. Yeah. That, that, whatever. But the redhead. <laughs> you still mad about that? No, I'm not <laughs> mad. I was just saying that is whatever because that situation wasn't like, well, at least from what, from what I know, it wasn't like this situation. I was like, that was really like... Because <laughs> like, you 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 observed that one, yeah. Like That's the only one you observed. Yeah, the other one I didn't know like how close y'all got. If you if you got as as close as that one with the other one, I'd have been like, yeah, you should have. Like, yeah, yeah. fuck it. But I, I just remember her friend was like, this is this is when I was like, I'll roll the dice on a white girl <laughs> with the red hair. Too? The, the red hair. I was like, yeah, they're known for being freaky. Yeah, I was like, mm hmm. <laughs> you like you like you play a sport. <laughs> You want to play with some ball? <laughs> like, you play water polo. <laughs> you get extra wet. 